New concerns tonight about plastics. Scientists and consumer groups faced off with the FDA today over the dangers of BPA, a chemical that many believe poses a serious health risk. Plastic bottles have become a huge part of the American way of life, but today there is new worrisome evidence about a chemical called BPA, or bisphenol A, in many of them. We found that the quarter of the population with the highest bisphenol levels were roughly at twice the risk of both heart disease and diabetes. The research came as the Food and Drug Administration, charged with regulating the composition of the bottles, held a public hearing on the possible hazard of the chemical. BPA can mimic the female hormone estrogen, and dozens of studies in animals show possible health effects. The chemical industry argues neither the animal studies nor the latest human research prove any danger. We believe that the weight of scientific evidence continues to support the safe use of these products, products such as baby bottles and water bottles made out of polycarbonate plastic or the epoxy resin coatings on the inside of most food and beverage cans. So far, the FDA has sided with the industry. We still believe that BPA is con should be considered safe. Many scientists who argued for a BPA ban today said they worry the latest research will be ignored. We're concerned that this is an agency that has stopped listening to its science advisors. Whatever the FDA's decision, many makers of bottles for babies and adults, including Nalgene, are now offering products that are free of BPA. Bottles that do have BPA have the number seven in a tiny triangle on the bottom. Again, not all the bottles have BPA, but Americans use 30 billion of them every year.